another video. So, I'm down in Mullingar, um, at the Kingfisher Hide. You can probably hear the swans in the background, look. So, I've been here about an hour and a half so far, and uh, there's no sign of the Kingfisher yet. Two hours left of light. So hopefully in the next two hours the Kingfisher will show up. But uh, I'll show you, I was photographing the Jays. I'll show you guys, I got this lovely photograph of one of the Jays. Up at one of the perches up here on the left, I'll show you. Look at that. Really like that. got some of the mink as well but I won't show these guys down there because I'm just trying to keep my movement and everything as little as possible but if the kingfisher doesn't show up at least I got a nice photograph of a jay but let's hope So I was here two days ago and uh, yeah, no success with the Kingfisher. So it's, it's six o'clock in the morning. I got here about half five, it was still dark. It's starting to light up and lighten up now a bit. So the sun has just come up. So hopefully Kingfisher will show up this morning. But uh, the last time I was here, I did it in the evening. Um, it didn't work out, so I've come now first thing in the morning. I'm going to try to be as quiet as possible. And uh, let's sit and wait. And hopefully the Kingfisher shows up.
What a morning, huh? Let me show you some of these foes. Ugh. You know, when the first, when the king kingfisher showed up twice, um, I've been here probably four hours now. Um, but yeah, the, the first time the kingfisher showed up, um, it was early. I think it was, I think it was half six, and uh, the light was, it was so dark. It was still kind of just getting bright. Um, my ISO was at like thirty two hundred. Um, it's like a hundred um, f six point three, and a hundred of a second uh, shutter speed. But um, I'll show you stuff. So I got some lovely ones up in this perch. Beautiful bird. In G Beauty. Look at that. But I got so many. There's just quite a few perches out there. So the Kingfisher likes to hop from each one. These ones are earlier. The first visit. And then you'll see the light drastically change here in some of these photos when. See here now. It's better light. This is the second visit. Was amazing. Check the frying pan. Finally made one of these. It's so handy, especially when you're in hides. When there's a table or a platform, you can just throw that down on top. And it's quite sturdy as well for some footage. But uh, what a morning with the kingfishers, huh? Definitely got three or four photos that I really like, I really like. Um, one of them is in the low light, it's, um, yeah, it's a ISO 3200, and the, the Kingfisher kept moving, so um, the lowest I could go with my shutter speed was like 100 of a second, so I literally just locked on focus and held the trigger down, but uh, because it's a mirrorless, I went it was on the silent shutter, so it didn't sound like a machine gun. But uh, oh, what a morning! I'm tired now because I didn't get much sleep last night. Because I wanted to get down here early in the morning. Um, I'm glad I did now. Right, so I'm gonna pack up now and head home. But um, I'll definitely be throwing the images over on the website, uh, seanmeadphoto.com. I'll be of adding it down into the Kingfisher's kill. I'll be adding it down into the Kingfisher section because um, I already have some photos of Kingfishers in there, and uh, over on the Instagram as well at uh, Sean Mead Photography. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, and sure, I'll see you on the next one.